Okay, so we have a concept called user experience, which means a design of the website. Okay, your website should be user friendly, which means if somebody wants to click open buy, the buy button should be easily visible, easily clickable at a particular point. You cannot hide the point. They should be able to click buy immediately. Okay, if you are selling a product, tell people buy now. If you feel hesitant that oh I am not supposed to tell people to buy it, don't hide it. Then people cannot find out where the button to buy or people will not even understand. Uh, so they really have to buy this product. So we should be telling this information to the people crystal clear. Okay, and make sure your device is good on mobile devices and uh, you have a secure server HTTPS secure server. Bounce rates reduce bounce rate, which means bounce rate is an action of returning immediately. The word bounce means you throw a ball against a wall, the ball returns, but we call it a bounce. The ball is bouncing, which means it returns in the same speed what it went in. So bounce rate, which means when someone comes, opens your website, okay, and uh, they don't find anything useful and they leave immediately, that is called bounce. And if your website has more bounce, which means you don't have a quality content, that's the meaning. Okay, and how much time it takes for your websites to load faster and the quality of the content. These things determine the experience of the user. So user experience is very important. Okay. Now here comes the social media platform. Once you create a content on your website that is called search engine optimization, you build backlinks for the website by sharing the content on social media, asking people, connecting with people, creating content and posting it on all the platform. Now, social media is altogether a different topic than a search engine, but social media plays a role. When you post a content in social media platforms like Facebook, Google, Twitter, LinkedIn, when people like the content, they tend to share it, they tend to put a like button, they tend to give reactions and all this stuff. The reactions, the share button, the like button tells Google a signal that, hey, this content is really good. People are sharing this content because they like it. So when there is a content which has more like, more share, or more comments, it is a symbol that the content is of good quality and people actually enjoying it. So the social media signals are one of the factors by Google to determine the quality content. So what you write with the good quality is one stuff. Okay? And what Google takes information from a social media platform is another stuff. So as a symbol of content quality, how longer your content is present on social media, how viral this content is, how it is being promoted is very important. Okay? So the social media signals are very, very important.